I wonder though, how does it feel knowing that you did more to help us in one day than you ever did to hurt us <laughs> in 30 years? Being inside the Vex core family, well, it has its privileges. We always reward our friends. You look like you've lost your best friend. Do you know that man? He used to be invisible, but I think he lost his powers. Invisible? May I sit with you? You have a story to tell. Twenty years I've been investigating conspiracies. I never really believed. Nothing was real until that day in the desert. You don't mind my saying you look a little lost. I'm just trying to remember where I left my wheels. I think, uh, I think they're out by the reactor. How close? About a mile. I'll give you a lift. I'm heading back to Cape Town if, uh, if that's good for you. Cape Town. You ever wonder who's really controlling things? Where these people come from? How they got to the top? It's a worldwide conspiracy. Of aliens. This thing go any faster? <laughs> I, 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 I took him as far as as far as Cape Town, but that explosion took him a lot further. What part of Cape Town do you live in? Cape City. Sorry. This guy an alien too? You don't know who that is, do you? you see, you see, that's Nelson Mandela. Easily recognizable anywhere in the world. And you don't know who he is. Maybe he was a stranger. No, no, not from out there, just from, from here, but, but not here. You're from a parallel universe. <laughs> what? I think he knew it all along. One man walked out of the desert that day. And because of him, I'll never look at the world the same way again. At least not in the time we have left. Who's helping you investigate us, Carl? No, I, I don't know what you mean. I have a choice, Carl. You can end up right here, a victim, or you can tell me what I want to know. No, no. I work alone. Goodbye, yeah. Carl. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. From Cape City, right? <laughs> There's no shame in this, Carl. You have to save yourself. I would. Hell, any sane man would. Now, let's start again at the beginning. What's his name? 
Sometimes I wish the hell I'd never met Charlie Jade. Cape City. That's a place Charlie J called home. A place where progress outstripped common sense a long time ago. A place where the city never ends. It just goes on and on, growing and growing. Run by five corporations. The biggest corporation of them all is Vexcor. Cape City was Charlie's turf. He lived a good life there. He had his own investigation business. Better to work all night for yourself than split shift for the man. <laughs> yeah, that's what you keep telling me. It's beautiful. Yes, you are. But Charlie was different in a completely unique way. He could see things and places no one could explain. You've had another sighting? Ah. Pills aren't working anymore. You want me to make them go away? Forever. Even if they're part of who you are? What Charlie couldn't know at the time was that the visions he was having were windows into parallel worlds. Fate was about to throw Charlie Jade a curve. A case led him out into the desert and straight into Vexcor's big mess. Mona, tap into his route map, find out where he's heading. Uh, it looks like the Vexcor security zone. What's the most valuable thing in your world, Carl? Diamonds, platinum, information. No. It's time. What's the most valuable resource there is? Time. <laughs>